years ago, I've always played a Fender Telecaster. My, the one I have is um, it's one of the rarest sounding guitars I've ever heard. I've played a lot of Telecasters over the years. I bought it 30 years ago. It was made in 1953, and the Fender Company has always been very supportive of, and, and grateful to me playing a Telecaster. And they thought that they would, uh, uh, they came to me and said, we'd like to make a Vince Gill model uh, Telecaster. And I said, you're out of your mind. I said, I said, I already play one, <laughs> first of all, <laughs> you know, so what's the point? But uh, I said, you're welcome to try. I said, but, uh, you know, I love the one I've got, um, and I don't think there's anything that will ever wean me off that guitar. And, and they did try and made a, a, a this is the only uh, Vince Gill model Telecaster that's ever been in existence. And uh, there was a pit guard on it somewhere that had my name on it, but I think it... Uh, disintegrated by the water or whatever, but um, this was a pretty good sounding guitar. Um, but like I said, as hard as Fender tried, they couldn't they couldn't surpass the one that I play every night and have for the last 30 years and will for the next 30. But this is a pretty rare piece.